Good morning. Oh my gosh. So I was just sent. I was just sent voice memos from Shane. His own voice. Shit talking me back from April 2017. Two months after we filmed his first series where I was him and he was me. And he's just like telling this influencer. I say his name's Charles Gross. Stuff that I told him. And I wasn't really shit talking Charles Gross, but Shane was shit talking me because I was friends with Peter Mon and I was just like asking him if he invited Charles Gross to this like Christmas party. But he was like mocking my voice in the audio. And like, I don't think it's like legal or morally right to share like audio messages, but I heard it for myself, like publicly. I heard it for myself and I'm like, I, it's the first time like I actually heard it from Shane's mouth, like being like, Trish, he's like, Trish, are we like kids? Like mocking my voice. I was. <sighs> So I did get um, an okay from Charles Gross to share this. But again, I don't know if I want to share the actual audio, but there it is because like I heard it with my own ears. I'm just like freaking out. You guys look April 2017 and he's gossiping about something I told him before a Christmas party in 2016. I don't even remember it. Like I do remember like talking to Peter Martin. This is so stupid. Like I just remember being like, yeah, like did you invite Charles? But he's like the way he said it on the audio was just like, yeah, Trish is like, ew, why would you do that? And he's like, Trish, is this all you have better to do is gossip? Shane, you are the biggest gossip and you're the meanest gossip. Yeah, maybe I was like, hey, yeah, Peter Mon said that you're inviting Charles Gross. I never said anything bad about him. He doesn't say that I said anything bad about him, but like, I'm not, I'm not mean. And I don't, look at you gossiping, like, to someone you don't even know. Like, I, I was his best, best friend. And I was just the stupid one. I was just the desperate one. I'm such an idiot. The audio is literally Shane in a mocking voice being me, being like, you invited this guy? Like, as, what? What? I have never said one bad thing about Shane privately, publicly, anything. Oh, I'm just like, I, I was like kind of getting myself together and like, just just like move on. Today's a new day. But I was just like, I'm so, I'm so shocked. I'm like, I'm, I've just never been so mind blown by someone so fake. Cause I, you will not find one voice memo of me bad talking Shane or saying something that Shane said to me in private or question. Like this is. Like, Shane's a gossip, yeah, but I didn't know he was so mean and, like, conniving behind people's back. Truly, I didn't know this. Like, he'd end friendships and he would, like, kind of tell me, but, like, also always just, like, paint himself as, like, a good person, like, never was being, like, mean. This is just, like, nasty shit, like, mocking. Like, I'm his best friend. We did, we did the first series together. I was going through so much that year, 2017. I did the series after my breakup with Sean, and he knew, like, in that series, I'm, like, going through it. Like, this is months later? Like, I was not mentally well this year. Like, I checked in with Shane about, like, this is... I'm so mind blown. I'm so mind blown. Like, you don't understand how bad I just, like, want to move forward. Like, I love making, like, TikToks and fun TikToks. Like, these are just so stupid. And, like, I hate that they're even on my feed. I'm just, like, I can't even, I can't even take it in, like, hearing, like, hearing his voice, right? Like, I've heard it from multiple people and, like, different people. And, like, okay. But, like, hearing him, like, mock me and say Trish told me four months ago about something. Like, just, and, and for what? To make Charles Gross feel like worse about I didn't say anything bad and he, he and he repeated that I didn't say anything bad it wasn't that it was just like more that I was like asking him like why he invited like Charles because like Peter Mon like didn't like him it, this was like so long ago like everything's like squashed but it's just like what was the point to make Charles feel bad to make me look bad to just shit on me for no reason to mock my voice like well I don't understand like it just it doesn't make any sense like just completely unwarranted like I know I do stuff that's like like rubs people the wrong way but I was so nice to Shane I never said anything bad about him I was always there for him like I'm so <laughs> it's like the wind has been knocked out of me <sighs> and like these are voice memos he sent to people no one's like privately recording him or anything like that which I heard other people do but like these are voice memos he sent and honestly like if you share a voice memo with me about Shane like and like I'm sure there's more like I'm not gonna share them obviously like I just it just like solidifies like I've, I think like, I already don't feel bad like I already feels like a weight has been lifted off me like I don't have any remorse about this friendship because like I did nothing to warrant this like this is the first time ever in my life in my career on YouTube that I didn't warrant this kind of response rebuttal attack like it's not even a response it was just like this weird attack for no reason and it just like it just I don't know I guess just like hearing it is just like yeah this person is a bad bad person like this is the one person i thought never talked bad about me that never like gossiped of like this is cr this is insane yeah i'm like processing all this like it's just this week has been hard anyways because it's like it's just it literally feels like i just didn't know this person peter mon's video he said he called me a sociopath and i'm just like oh. Oh. 
So just to touch on that, like Peter Ma made a video talking about like when he met up with Shane in Vegas. And this was like around like, I don't know, 2018. And um, I like and I guess he said that like Trisha said she'd meet up with me or something in Vegas. And to which Shane said to that, oh, yeah, Trisha said she'd meet up with me in Vegas. That's what Peter told Shane. Shane's response to that was Trisha's a pathological liar. Like what? What is the point? It's not like I said, you know, Shane's this or made up rumors about someone. I said, oh, I would love to meet up with you. To which Shane's response is Trisha's a pathological liar. Peter Ron also goes on to say that he says that Tana is a sociopath, Jake Paul's a sociopath, and then I'm a sociopath. Oh my God. Shane, you're not a psychologist. Not everyone's a sociopath. <laughs> oh my God. You give this guy a series of fake therapists and an ego, and all of a sudden he just knows everything about psychology and he can diagnose anyone as a sociopath. Like what? Make it make sense. And he said Andrew and Garrett, and they were there like laughing in Ryland. Why? Why did I warrant that? Why did I warrant my best friend called me a pathological liar and a sociopath? Yeah, to reiterate, what? this isn't Shane saying this in defense of himself. Well, Trisha's a pathological liar. It's not like I made up a rumor about Shane and he's like, well, Trisha's a pathological liar. Like, he just said this because I said I wanted to meet up with Peter, which I did meet up with him and do a video in my apartment. Okay? A so he just said I'm a sociopath for no reason. Like, he just met this guy, Peter Mon, for the first time. And he knew me nine years at that point. And just decided to randomly say Trisha's is a sociopath? I think, like, this is... Like, even him telling Charles Gross all this, like, what is the... What is the point? I mean, clearly he had some issue with me or some issues himself. If he's telling Gabby, Hannah, I have herpes, which... I'm going to show next week on my podcast, like my results, like I don't, but it's like, wh why, why are you just making this stuff up? Why are you just saying this? What is the point though? Like, what is the point to humiliate me, to make me look stupid, to paint your own narrative of me, like to look, make me look like a clown for being friends with you. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Bye.